afternoon. So we are back live on YouTube and Instagram. Let us start our today's session. Uh, let's have a case first. If everybody joins us very early, and very memorable seminar we had in Bombay with full house and a full house. It was really very nice and good interaction with the crowd, the students. So let us have uh, again some of the questions which were unanswered. I'll start that first, and then maybe we'll take the questions. So one question was there if the patient, yeah, welcome Ravi, welcome Dr. Ajit. One question was there, and there was related more towards you know uh, decay of teeth. I'll just uh, tell you a case where we took the whole case. It, it was a skin of skin problem. It we took the whole case. The case was much better improving, but a status quo appeared. And on recording the history, we say we heard that the patient had taken uh, had lot of root canal treatment about seven to eight teeth. Had a root canal treatment. He was just in uh, doing his engineering. So with that, basically we prescribed a remedy called acid flow, which has those complaints. And within three to four days, the patient started feeling mentally better, and all the skin complaints just vanished. So sometimes you know you have to see what is the more syphilitic part in the human body. Sometimes we don't take care of that lot of caries in the teeth or lot of root canal treatment. Treatment has been done. Those are syphilitic, you know. And if it occurs in a case of a young boy and you're studying between twenty to twenty five or thirty years, it becomes a very very important prescribing symptom. We'll come Palak, Wan, Shreya, Raham, Omar, Shafiq, Ahmed. Hmm. I'm medicine. I'm taking. I'm getting a benefit. Okay, okay. Shafiq, Ahmed. So in caries, you have to remember three four remedies which are very very important. And those remedies that are important that you should know. See, normally we have that symptomatic, you know, whether crown decays early or the gums decay or the gums at the edge decay or the root decay. We have several remedies, but in general, I would like to tell you that three, four, four or five remedies which are very, very important that you should remember in your daily practice. I hope on YouTube people are able to see me and hear me, okay? Because uh, I don't see uh, any response from YouTube. Then Thuja. And then nitric acid, and then creosote. You know, those are all the remedies. But I have found very good results with fluoric acid. As I told you, natrum carb, plumbum metallicum, stephes agria, creosote, thuja, and mercury. So these are very very important that you understand when to when to prescribe and when to take this symptom. You know, the patient will not come to you. Okay, I have a decayed teeth. Please treat that. So this is important that if it is syphilitic and if it, if you are feeling that your case has come to a standstill, then you have to think about some uh, ways to enter that syphilitic miasm and cure that patient. I hope you understand that. Uh, stomatitis, cancer, sure. Buccal cavity, if bruised, give Muxol 30 with little relief. Should I give Cifilinum 1M? Hello, Doctor Babel. See, uh, if there is recurrent stomatitis, uh, shanker, sores, buccal cavity. No, see, I basically, if you ask me that uh, suddenly, you know, why the patient is suffering from, you know, if you have uh, read Doctor Kent's Sorik Myasm, he says that uh, when the man sins, when the man sins, the sora goes deep inside, and then we have symptoms of psychosis and syphilis. So you have to ask what happened to that. Just giving syphilis because it is syphilitic myasm. Okay, if it suits the case very well, but. Three four remedies that you should think about are very very important. You can write down, doctor. I don't know the name. Kali Chlor, first, second, again very important arsenic, third, Merck Cor, and then fourth you must think about Muxol. So these are important remedies that you should think about. Cefalinum basically you can give definitely you can give, but then you have to have some symptoms of cefalinum that acridity and that syphilitic state has to be there. If it is there, then you can always prescribe cefalinum. डॉक्टर शफीक सर वेट लॉस के लिए बताइए या शफीक हम अभी फिलहाल डॉक्टर से रूबरू कर रहे हैं हम बाद में बताते हैं इसके लिए ओके वैष्णव ज्योति गुड आफ्टरनून अलेक्जेंडर हेलो सो दिस इज या वेलकम डॉक्टर उमर डॉक्टर धर्मिक सो दिस इज हाउ यू हैव टू डिफरेंशिएट एंड इफ यू हैव डिस्ट्रक्टिव लीजन यू नो आई एम आई एम जस्ट दैट्स व्हाई टेलिंग यू डॉक्टर केन स्कोट दैट ही सेस द द व्हेन द मैन सिंस द माइजम स्टार्ट्स कमिंग अदरवाइज सोरा बेसिकली इज अ बेसिक स्टेट ऑफ ह्यूमन नेचर The sin goes down deep in the layer, deep in the human economy. Then psychosis and syphilis comes, 
and then you can see on the face the aura what the, the atmosphere what the patient say uh, what dr ken says a cuff that it, it ends with a sound like a drum beat what rubric uh, would you take just a minute problem seeing after epilepsy some image hidden ex example two names on a card next to each other only the first is recognized later lost don't have more information uh, welcome dr avni problem seeing after epilepsy yeah whenever you get these type of symptoms after epilepsy you must take one symptom and one rubric uh, very very important in, in or a remedy that you must think about do write down dr babal the remedies first you must think about abrotenum because now because of see apoplexy the disease apoplexy has gone and now it has shown symptom in relation to eyes so abrotenum is very very important naxomica important third remedy you think about is carbovage and fourth you must think about is uh, lacasis and cuprum metallicum Uh, a cough that it ends uh, like a sound of a drum. Uh, welcome, Doctor Ganurka. Whenever the cough, you know, uh, basically you you must see, uh, see the cough with metallic sound. No, it's a metallic sound, or it's a, like a drum. So whenever I'll tell you one metallic sounding cough and drum like. See, there are two different different thing. Now only if you are prescribing on the sound. then you have to be very sure that it actually like is like a drum what the patient feels and what you feel so drum and metallic sounding cuff are very very close together first like metallic sounding cuff you must think about kali bicrom spongia rumex if you have drum type then again spongia mephitis and drosera if you have seen my uh, differentiating features of how to differentiate drosera spongia rumex and mephitis very very important uh, a drosera patient what i have seen in my practice apart from the dry cough the patient who holds the hypogastrium on coughing that is drosera spongia cough very very typical you have to understand that the patient is better by eating rumex the patient aggravated by cold air voice is lost and the patient holds the mouth on uh, and feels better and mephitis is dyspnea while talking the the, the the breathing becomes asthmatic while talking okay two things are there sir please share experience with lecithin for increasing bp no i have not used ever lecithin for increasing the bp uh, sorry hb hemoglobin for simple uh, increase in the hemoglobin if you use i think ferrumfos in bio chemical trituration you will get good results lecithin i have not used okay it's a pregnant goat okay now whenever a goat coughs you know most of the time the sound of that cough is the goat is drum like because most of them we see as a dry cough so in that case you 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 must see when i when i am treating animals you know you have to see if the dry cough and you give just water to the goat uh, which type of water warm water normal water or tap water or cold water is the goat better or you give something to eat especially something to eat and especially sweets the and then she is better and that modality would basically help you in treating a, a cuff of goat and if definitely which part of the day morning evening and night and whether the air the cold air aggravates though you open air aggravates or ameliorates and the hot part this is a differentiating feature in case of goat because most of the cuff which i also get of goat are basically dry cuff uh your experience of nosod in high potency like 50 mm or cm yeah basically what happens doctor uh, doctor best i don't know your name so whenever i am using a nosod if i am using a nosod as a nosod as an uh, so i basically if you have break open the case or open up the case i basically be, uh, give basically one m potency but if i am using a nosod as a general medicine as a um, uh, constitutional medicine then i would basically start with 200 potency nizamuddin this is this was a very important question again was asked in my just two days back i had a seminar in bombay it was a wonderful experience you know of seminar in bombay and that this was a question again asked to me and there are a lot of questions in relation to no sores lm potency what to give at what time it it basically depends upon your reading of that organ of medicine 6th edition and your experience okay one try this this temporarium 200 or 3 months is supposed to restore the myelin sheath in multiple sclerosis no no i have not experienced in uh, this remedy 
this uh, temporinum i have not in fact i have never used this remedy for myelin sheath but uh, i would not uh, know and because i have never prescribed this but in case of myelin sheath in case of multiple sclerosis you know it is multiple sclerosis so there are a lot of multiple causes when the patient goes rise to uh, multiple sclerosis i had an interesting case of multiple sclerosis though the patient is not cured but the patient is much much better i have used in that case trichinum fos lm potency with very good results dr geeta welcome yeah if she wants to take it i she can take it you know uh, I, but i, I can't uh, tell you because i have no experience in case of multiple sclerosis but if she wants to take it for a, over a period of 3 months i think it's would be better to take in lm potency rather than c potency you know otherwise the body gets immune to that same potency because the vital force is not uh stimulated because the potency is same so to stimulate the vital force if you get back to a higher potency by 10 strokes in lm potency the vital force is moved and you can get to the next level results other it would be same twitching of muscles during sleep see nowadays there will be a lot of problems you know when the patient comes when there is twitching in, in especially in children you know Uh, make sure that the patient basically does not have a problem where he has lack of fluids lack of electrolytes and these type of complaints and but still if you want to know the remedies you know i'll tell you both the types where there's twisting in sleep during and in twi- and twisting is better in sleep so whenever there's twisting of uh, extremities during sleep you have to think three remedies first think about heliboros second think about strontium carb third think about lycopodium and fourth think about zincum metallicum if the twisting is better in sleep then you must think about agaricus muscarius welcome dr sharen uh good afternoon sir sabji thank you dr elizabeth but after some time uh listening to the music become a little better see uh, a very very important symptom you know uh, doctor uh, i know doctor poro poro are you if the patient says that listening to music she feels better so that jumping out of the window would be an impulsive reaction to of the patient but this is a very very interesting symptom you know and you can say uh, uh, you can say that uh, ocu- uh, divergent emulates and then you can take that rubric and go to the remedy uh uti has not yeah dr navjot i have seen your message and i could not call you because i at the seminar in bombay and then i came back and there was a lot of rush so i'll tell you today uh, don't worry about that i'll just tell you the remedy because i just saw your uh, uh, whatsapp message and i was busy in my seminar in bombay you must have seen the photographs and all so i'll tell you, tell you the remedy now hello sir please explain case of multiple sclerosis that you gave medicine recently yeah it, it was a long case i was just telling you my experience dr sharon of strachinum fos i'll get back to you but i'll just finish the question here uh, i'll just yeah dr krutika welcome yeah so that was a case of a very interesting case of uh, multiple sclerosis where he had taken a lot of other homeopathy medicines with lot of good doctors though she, he was not improving uh, so by the case taking of syphilitic case taking i would say we came around the remedy strachinum fos and nelm potency and is much better so i tell you in, in cases where you have to repeat rather than repeating L, uh, c potency 200 3 times a day for 3 months you must basically take lm potency so that you can increase the potency every day you give 10 strokes dr shadab sheik welcome jyoti vaishnav alopecia edita how to enter the case i had a case of alopecia universalis which i showed in my bombay seminar no hair is in the body after treatment hair started coming the only way to enter these type of cases dr vaishnav do remember it is syphilitic part of the patient's case taking you have to know that syphilitic part otherwise you will not be able to cure it don't give the rose remedy like phosphorus or visbardine or vinca minor they will not cure the complaint the care the patient will keep repeating those who have attended my mumbai seminar i showed about how many cases 10 to 15 cases in just 3 hours beautiful seminar in that i showed two cases of alopecia cured and one case of alopecia on the verge of cure you know 
डॉक्टर रेमेडीज फॉर परप्यूरा इन ओल्ड एज सी गुड आफ्टरनून डॉक्टर सचदेवा सो वेन एवर यू हैव परप्यूरा डॉक्टर मेंडे इन ओल्ड एज डोंट लेबल इट एज ओल्ड एज यू नो इन ओल्ड एज नॉर्मली बिकॉज ऑफ सर्क्युलेटरी वीकनेस बिकॉज ऑफ लॉट ऑफ अदर थिंग्स ओल्ड एज प्रॉब्लम्स यू गो यू गेट दीज टाइप ऑफ कंप्लेन्स सिंपल सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू ट्रीट दोज कंप्लेन्स जस्ट मेक श्योर द फर्स्ट रेमेडी द फर्स्ट रेमेडी इज आर्निका दैट एवरीबडी नोज बट डोंट लेबल एज ओल्ड एज बिकॉज इफ यू लेबल इज एट ओल्ड एज देन यू नॉट बी एबल टू बेसिकली प्रिस्क्राइब एक्सेप्ट ओल्ड एज सो इन परप्यूरा देर आर थ्री टू थ्री थिंग्स वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट दैट यू हैव टू थिंक फर्स्ट इज आर्निका देन यू मस्ट थिंक अबाउट सल्फ्यूरिक एसिड देन यू थिंक अबाउट लेडम पाल देन यू थिंक थिंक अबाउट मर्क सॉल लैकसिस एंड दोज टाइप ऑफ रेमेडीज ओके some potencies uh, some questions have been scrolled up so if i have not answered do uh, write it again yeah cough because of post nasal discharge in children sticky discharge white color cough constant aggravation lying down whenever you have these type of complaints that the cough is bed aggravated by lying down and then you have to see how much sticky the discharge is If the discharge is very much sticky, you know, simple remedy is like what do you call? Kali bicrom would cure that case. But the patient says that uh, continues, continues cough on lying down. There are so many remedies, you know. There are very there are a lot of remedies. So you can write down, but you must see if the stickiness of discharge is there. That is very important that you prescribe Kali bicrom. Lying down aggravation three remedies, Doctor Sasdeva, very very important. Please write down in in your notes because if you don't get any symptom and you are happy that this symptom of lying down will cure the case, first remedy hyoscyamus, second remedy pulsatilla, third remedy phosphoric acid, and fourth remedy scaly brom. These four remedies are very very important. Then just go one step ahead in case taking. Ask better uh, lying on back aggravates lying on back or sides, and then the remedy would change. hair loss after stopping the pill whole head hair loss after stopping the pill that means that contraceptive pill then you have to start the remedy while see when you uh, if you have i have already told if you have boric mat remedy uh, naxonic is there carbovage is there but if you have boric mat remedy ka allosocretina the first two lines to re establish the equilibrium in the body you can prescribe allosocretina in one potency which has given me good results Doctor Vivekanand, Doctor Indrajit, knee pain due to injury. The pain increases after waking. Please help. See, whenever the word, whenever the word injury comes, and whenever the word comes because of waking, there are two different things. Now, whenever you have injury, first remedy, of course, everybody, everybody knows that you must think about Arnica Montana. But now you have added that it is waking on more. so then you have to add few more remedies in this case in that you have to think first about silicia causticum sulfur nitric acid and i think uh, cp is also there coffee is constant day and night see whenever you have uh, whenever you have remedies whenever you feel that the patient has cough now whenever there is cough and the cough you say it is very constant dry and day and night first of all understand when the cough is almost constant again i had a case similar case where the cough was almost constant but the patient said when i when the cough starts it does not stop so cough aggravate coughing i took and gave ignisha three four remedies with the cough is almost constant the remedies you think about is alumina arnica Vaselina, but I had that case prescribed by Ignisha because Ignisha is cough aggravated cough. Any other remedy you uh, that comes to your mind where it is written cough aggravated by coughing? Anybody? You can think and give me the answer. A male, sixty-four years, bilateral kidney cyst, right pleural effusion, chronic hypertensive patient. Okay, Doctor Vivekana. See, whenever there is a bilateral kidney cyst. so make sure in this case if you are if you are prescribing to a patient if you are not able to cure that cyst 
still make sure that you stop the progress of disease because if the cyst starts increasing the patient lands up in renal failure you know and when there is renal failure and plus we have told that the patient is chronic and hypertensive so it will it will add on to renal failure and the patient will be on dialysis so in this case if there is a bilateral cyst make sure that you are able to at least stop the progress of the disease chronic hypertensive condition that means the patient basically has gone through lot of trauma in life lot of stress in life and that's why there is hypertension do ask the history and in this case make sure that whatever remedy you are prescribing if you have that remedy in lm potency give that because you will require repetition i hope you understand what i was telling you about allosocretina i think if you have that matter medica please read allosocretina i hope uh, i know it is a very rare remedy but if you see allosocretina in borix matter medica it is written very very clearly you know if it reestablishes the equilibrium such an important remedy always don't think about uh, what you call naxomeca and carboido they see they, they are there but if you see first line boric matter medica it is written it, it is an excellent remedy to aid in reestablishing the physiological equilibrium after much dosing where disease and drug symptoms are mixed that is a beautiful explanation of allosocretina of course it has those symptoms also of the stools with mucus and lot of symptoms of colitis but this symptom is also very important here and scalp which is in a asthmatic 44 year old male dr vanch thank you so uh, here and scalp which is see whenever you are case uh, treating a case of uh, asthma and if you feel that after what you call the treatment the there is itching in the ear then there is no need to treat the case and if you are treating a case of asthma and there is itching of the ear itching maybe is a soric symptom asthma becomes soro psychotic so you have to take that in important you know and then you have to prescribe itching in the ear maybe with asthma you can think three four remedies which are that comes to my mind first remedy is naxomica second is oram metallicum third is sulfur fourth is soranum and fifth is cpm i know my answers of matter medica would be very fast so keep a pen and paper so that you don't have to ask me on whatsapp that what i told about that question you know then uh, dr uh, pande do ask about uh, when is the itching in the ear which ear it is more left side right side morning evening night as it as it if you take symptoms in detail automatically your remedy will become more precise and you will be able to judge that similarly very easily okay yeah so any other question in instagram yeah dr vanch allo socrates i hope you have heard and i have told in lot many of my uh, lectures about it. in fact in allo socrates i you know uh, it is written that bad effects of sedentary life bad effects of sedentary life normally we think about naxomica only but in allosocretina that is also given so see how a remedy of allosocretina caliber which be basically most of us study for abdomen complaints and rectum complaints but it covers such a wide variety of symptoms that you should think about so keep reading your matter medica you know, everything is in your hand don't keep running for those rare remedies of course you have you take it but our polycrest remedies also have such such symptoms and material in it other that if you keep reading every day you will and then interpretation how you interpret is important you will be more successful in your practice you know that's why keep reading people ask me how you learn matter medica that's how i learn matter medica keep reading and everybody see has one affinity and one uh, attachment to a book some like clark some like borix some like Kent, some like Salen, some like Dube, a lot of matter medica. So it, it's basically when you start reading different books, you automatically get attached to one book, you know, and that's that's how basically you uh, get to know about that. So any other question? Yeah, never thought about aloes. Yes, doctor, to one. So keep reading so that it will be very easy for you to understand your matter medica better. Uh, sparkling samir parvez alam 25 years of a lady problem of hair fall dandruff and dry hair suggest medicine 
Okay, so whenever see whenever you have a case where there is lot of dandruff, if you have red phosphorus, you know uh, phosphorus in your mater medica, we had been said that dandruff falls like you know cloud, that is phosphorus. So if you don't get anything, phosphorus is definitely there in in our mater medica. So dandruff itching and in the scalp. Think about phosphorus. Think about graphitis. Think about nitromure, sulfur, carbon sulf. Carbon sulf is also very very interesting remedies. I would go one step further, Doctor Parvez. If the dandruff is white in color, thuja, nitromure, and phosphorus. If it is yellow in color, I think kali sulf and calcarea carb are important. Okay. Uh, sciatica right side is like bursting constant pain and night aggravation and lying down yeah dr mandik cough aggravate cough is ignition there are other remedies also in my bombay seminar i had taken the the, the symptom of cough and presented a case of cough and we prescribed that remedy not ignition so sciatica right side is ha huh. so let's see sciatica this question has been asked me lot of times but i hope uh, i hope uh, you will be able to understand it is of right side so whenever you have sciatica especially of right side i know it's a very painful condition so there's a problem and with the modality write down this remedy is dr sesdeva if you are confused you can think about these three four remedies and then differentiate with the knowledge of mater medica phytolica colosynth lacasis lacopodium dyscoria very very important right sided sciatica still lacasis becomes a very very important remedy you don't always label that as uh, see uh, right side not lacasis but if you see the mater medica if you see basically our repertory it is written in right side sciatica lacasis is also there dr mende there are few remedies you can go home and say dr mende sir medicines for newborn baby cold see there is no question of new or old born but uh, simple remedy simple symptomatic you know you have to see that newborn will have because of his age, as he grows that he get accustomed to the environment and because of that the body throws out symptom simple remedy start with start with allium sipa justicia aurelia arsenic a lot of remedies are there i just cured a case of a, a one month old baby lot of sneezing lot of discharge from the nose uh, i saw the case very very mild child sleeping not disturbing the parent but still i prescribed just single dose of chamomile 30 and the case was cured so symptoms are important you know mona swami just joined in welcome sir medis okay so uh, symptoms are important you know so simple remedy justicia uh, allium sipa could have uh, will cure your case you know yes any other questions i hope you get the information of the time of the uh, youtube you know because it is 3:30 30 if you join late then uh, you miss, you miss out on lot of answers you know a lot of questions scope of db in homeopathy uh, dr samir db means what you talking about if you could cal- clarify never thought yes so cough agarout coughing agnesia is there one remedy also is there that is squilla a fantastic remedy and if you see squilla you will be so much confused with squilla and drosera and sponge you know squilla has dry cough squilla has continuous cough squilla has cough day and night squilla has violent cough squilla has tormentic cough squilla has cough with pain lot of symptoms of squilla you know you will be confused that actually it is squilla or drosera or sponge or mephitis or rumex so mathematic and differentiating remedies is very very important now that you i think i've understood since two years i'm taking my youtube you've understood how to get the remedy for for remedy now when you get for for remedies it is important to start differentiating those remedies you know with symptoms that's important and that will be make you very good and a better prescriber if anyone is there from bombay seminar uh, i hope you got that seminar i hope you understood that seminar because uh, i had given only 2 hours time but i stretched till 3 hours and i hope you will write your reviews how was the seminar so that every time i can improve on giving a lecture so i think all question answered there is no other question so everybody thank you thank you for joining me and i hope you enjoyed uh, 
uh, hearing as much as I enjoyed teaching you. Thank you so much.